Guys, welcome back to Supercar Street Racing today. And I've got my elderberry and echinacea tea here. And my Smith & Wesson knife here, which means I'm stuck right in the middle of confusion on my mood today when I open this product. Guys, Supercar Street Racing here with Brad. I've got my delicious, I'm addicted to tea, so I have my tea here. And right behind my awesome tea, we see this box from Walmart, and we are going to be using this lovely Smith & Wesson knife to enjoy opening this cardboard condom on this Walmart box so that we can take a look into what's inside. This came from walmart.com, free shipping. And I think it was $11 a piece. Very controversial product and I will tell you why and why I'm stuck with these for now while I'm researching. But inside of this box, we have a bunch of protection, which we can get some enjoyment out of popping satisfaction guaranteed and then we have these mainstays 35 count LED Ed Edison string lights these are the Walmart brand mainstays and there is a lot of controversy over these lights because they have incredibly bad reviews online and I am going to look into that with you shortly, but inside of this box you can see here we have three of these. Each one of these is 31 feet long. They are LED and they ran me $11 a piece. They have been as cheap as $8 each, but they of course have gone up just like everything else. Wow, this tea is absolutely fantastic. Um, love it. It's like Pukka tea, P-U-K-K-A, just awesome, and it was buy one, get one free. I should have bought a bunch of them. Couldn't even think about it. So, yeah, so the mainstays. I have three boxes here. The reason I have three boxes is because these things fail monumentally all the time, and I am stuck with them until I can find a better replacement, because if you start replacing one on the string, they don't match all the other ones. So for now, we have three of these Edison things, which we will unbox one and take a look inside the box and see what is in there and how it is packaged. Okay, when you open the box, you see that this is a confusion of tangleness. That looks like a five-year-old packaged and it is super fun to untangle because they literally just throw it all in the box like that and that is what you're left with. So all the lights are just in this cardboard thing and if you just kind of take this part out and then unthread these parts out of the cardboard it tends to work out and maybe if you're lucky a few little bulbs fall off here and there but yeah that is the inside of the packaging on the mainstays 35 count Edison string light bulb and now we will take a look online and see why these are so unpopular. All right, guys, we are in front of the Supercar Street Racing editing rig now with you, and we are broadcasting on our brand new HyperX mic here, hoping that the audio is sounding good. There's a little bit of an echo in this room, so you might hear that on the microphone because it's quite sensitive. But right in front of us here, we have the Mainstays 35 count LED Edison bulb outdoor string lights for you to check out. Now these guys are $11.72 and here's a, t a look at the picture and they are warm white. Uh, so if you were wondering, a lot of people ask that question online and yes, they are warm white. Um, they actually look pretty good. The dome things, the little globe things right there are plastic. They are not glass. They just got a standard little 
candle looking LED bulb inside. And here's how they kind of look strung across your fence there. Pretty easy to set up and string. They are kind of tangled when you get them though. And as it says down here, it says that they have a black wire. They have 35 warm, steady burning lights. Um, says they're 20% brighter than whatever was before and flicker free. They definitely don't flicker. And it says it has a rectifier plug. Not sure what that is or, or means, but uh, you can connect a bunch of sets of these together. I have about 10 sets connected together outside on the fence, which I'll show you later. Once it gets dark, we're actually gonna go outside and we're gonna show you why these things have such a bad review on walmart.com. But they are the cheapest possible lights for this length. And so let's get into that in a minute. It says that they'll last uh, forever, which they're definitely lying. Um, it says that maximum 216 watts or 1.8 amps, and that would be, I guess, with all the lights connected together. And then it says um, 30 maximum, and they do put out a 2700 K, 2700 Kelvin color temperature, which is towards the warm side. When you get up to the 5000, you're in the more blue side, and 6,000-ish is getting towards the white side. So it's perfect for outdoor use, but I will tell you now that these things will not last very long. They are disposable, just like I wrote in my review, which I will show you. And that's about it as far as the actual description of the product. Let me get some more of my delicious tea here. If you go look around for other brands and other in the same length, you will see the price even triple, but they might be worth it because these guys do not last very long. Let's go into the reviews here because these guys have a 3.4 review. Look right here. 3.4 out of 400 reviews. Very, very poor. Now they will let you return them. So... You should keep a box handy because you will be returning these within 90 days. I've not done it, but my plan this time is to return these if they fail. Tea is so yummy. I know I already said that a hundred times, but hey, it's good stuff. Taking a look at the reviews here, let's look at some of the good reviews first. Got some five-star reviews here. Lights up the nightlife. Plastic versus glass. I love these so much. Couldn't put them outside. And bright. Cord is long. Wish the light was a little more yellow. They're pretty warm. They're not, they're not cool. They're definitely not 5,000K. They're in the 3,000-ish range. A lot of good reviews, but let's step down to the two-star reviews now. Lights going out already. Lasted a couple of weeks. Well... That's why you have returns, which I've never used. I haven't been smart enough to do that, but I'm about to start now because I'm gonna return some of these because I have failed ones already that I bought. Another two-star review. These don't even last one month. Defective, did not last. Lights went out after two weeks. Cute lights, but not the best quality. Do not last, short-term use only, not happy. Don't let it rain on them, that is true. Not weatherproof, also true. Let's go down to the one stars. All three of these are going back, by the way. I will show you why when we step outside later into the backyard. Stop working after one week. Good until it rains a few times and then the lights go off. You get what you pay for, terrible quality. Half the lights stopped working in two days after we got them, you get what you pay for. Cute, but not waterproof. Now, you notice the seller has not responded to any of these because they do not care about this because they are selling them, a lot of them. Here is my review, look at this. Somebody gave me a thumbs down. <laughs> well, thanks for the thumbs down, buddy. 
I call these disposable lights, buy a warranty, the lights will last anywhere from a day to a month and then die. Always get a protection plan if you can. Think of them as costing five times as much because they die immediately, either several bulbs or all the bulbs. And, and you can thumbs down me all you want, but that is the absolute truth. And I don't know why you would thumbs down a true review. Bite me. Anyway, more tea. I purchased 12 of these and within three weeks of purchase, all 12 did not work. Every one went little by little until three weeks. And there is page after page of these. There is eight pages of one star reviews. When you get to the last pages, they don't say anything. They just give a one star. But within raining two days, mine aren't mine's should not have an S, but mine aren't working at all. I bought two of them and less than a month are damaged. These lights cast a soft, nice soft light, bought three sets for outdoors in less than a month, 10 lights out of one strand, five lights out of another, and one strand dimmed to useless. Now what you will see will happen actually is bulbs will start failing on the actual string. It comes with extra bulbs. I've tried to replace the bulbs. It doesn't work. They just don't come back on. It doesn't restore the whole string or even the bulb that you replace. Sometimes you can replace all the bulbs and they still don't work. This thing says utter trash, garbage. So you get the point here. They have gone up in price and they were $8 at one point where I bought like 15 sets and have used them all because I had to put a bunch out there for the beginning. And so when I see you guys next, we will go ahead and go outside and start the process of replacing the ones that I need to replace and starting a return on these guys. This return policy can be returned to the store or by mail. Items picked up and delivered from a store can only be returned to a store, but we can return online items in a store for free and that's what we will do. We will get rich to bring us and get our money back for these. And next we'll go outside to the yard. All right, we are out in the backyard now and we are going to walk the property and take a look at the state of these lights, which I have not done in a while. And over here we see we have a bulb out there, which maybe we can replace. There's one out there. These come with spare bulbs, supposedly. We'll see what's in the package. There's one out there, there. That's already what, five, six, there, seven. And this entire string is out. So first things first, we go, we'll replace this string that's out. So let's get doing moving with that.
Okay, I just got done doing bulb replacements on as many as I could. It looks like I'm going to have to replace a whole section over there that's bad because I tried three different bulbs and they would not work. Now I'm going to package all these up here and get them returned to Walmart. 